Hi, I'm Dave Smith, Marketing Manager for TI's MSP430 FRAM Microcontroller Portfolio. Today, I'd like to introduce our new energy efficient hardware accelerator designed to enable increased levels of ultra low power MCU signal processing. In many of today's applications, there's an increasing need for embedded microcontrollers to carry out complex processing tasks such as FFT or FIR filters without sacrificing power consumption. To answer this need, we're introducing a new low energy accelerator for signal processing applications or LIA for short. The LIA module is a highly optimized fixed function vector math engine that is hosted within various MSP430 devices. These complex functions would typically require a significant amount of time and CPU cycles, equating to a significant energy requirement being needed to perform these functions. Operating without any CPU intervention, the LIA module is a low power coprocessor that performs operations and triggers interrupts when the function is completed. It can operate either concurrently to the main CPU, allowing multiple tasks to be completed in parallel, or it can operate while the CPU is in a low power sleep mode, triggering an interrupt once the specific task has been completed. The LIA module operates with a fixed set of commands, each of which is optimized for maximum performance with minimum energy usage. LIA commands are made easy to use through the use of the MSP DSP library, which is optimized for MSP430 MCUs enabling more than 50 individual signal processing functions. As an example, when performing a 16-bit complex 256-point FFT in an MCU with the LIA module, compared to the same function running on an ARM Cortex-based MCU utilizing the ARM CMSYS DSP library, the MCU with the LIA is approximately 40 times faster than the ARM Cortex M0+, 10 times faster than the ARM Cortex M3, and up to four times faster than the ARM Cortex M4 FCPU. In addition, as the LIA module runs at around 67 microamps per megahertz, we are not only using far fewer cycles, but we are operating at a lower current consumption than most microcontrollers. The combined effect of fewer cycles and lower current consumption results in a significant energy saving per function. This means that the MCU can remain in a low power mode longer, saving more energy and further extending battery life. The first device to include the new LIA module is the MSP430 FR5994. This device is a 16-bit ultra-low power microcontroller from TI's MSP430 range of FRAM MCUs. Featuring 256 kilobytes of FRAM, 8 kilobytes of shared SRAM, AES hardware accelerator, 12-bit 200 kilosample SAR ADC, a 32-bit hardware multiplier, and the LIA vector math accelerator. To help customers evaluate the new LIA peripheral, we have created a TI design. This is a reference design that uses the MSP430 FR5994 on-chip analog to digital converter to capture a signal from a microphone. The MCU then processes the audio signal with either an FFT function, displaying the resulting frequency spectrum on a liquid crystal display, or by running a real-time audio FIR filter the filtered audio being output to a speaker or headphone jack. When in FIR filter mode, the filter coefficients can be changed to modify the filter characteristics between low pass, high pass and band stop, with varying cutoff frequencies by simply pressing a button. As with other TI designs, this package includes all of the necessary hardware and software components needed to reproduce this quickly and efficiently. For more information on the LIA module and the new MSP430 FR5994 device, please see ti.com slash LIA.